Hello YouTube! Now, I've decided to do another Calibre video. We've already covered in stage 1 how to send RSS news feeds to your Kindle phone. So now we're going to go on to this stage which is once you've downloaded books off the internet I'm going to show you how you can transfer the files to your Kindle. Now I've gone ahead and fired up the program and as you can see up here it says device up here and that's because I've already got my Kindle connected via the USB lead. Now when you transfer to the Kindle there's two ways you can go about it. You can do the old fashioned way of have the cable connected like this and then you transfer from the program to the Kindle via the USB lead or if you've followed um, the steps in my previous video your Calibre program will be set up to use email so you don't have to have the Kindle connected you can just email the videos uh, not the videos sorry the um, the ebooks now I've downloaded two books I've downloaded a ePub and a Moby. Now an ePub book is a common electronic publishing format on the internet for e-reader books and the other format I've downloaded is Moby which is the I, I assume, it, I'm not too sure what it stands for, I presume it's just Moby as in mobile and that's what the Kindle supports. Now we're going to add these to the library for Calibre now so if we go up here to add books and click that both these have been downloaded to my desktop so we've got the Moby which is the Kindle format and then over here we've got the EPUB which is the the common format you'll encounter on the internet now we're going to go ahead and we're going to do a direct transfer on this one to demonstrate how to transfer and convert one of these common formats so if we double click on this this will now add this to my Calibre library. There we go. As you can see, I've downloaded Tale of Two Cities by Charles Dickens. Now, I want to put this onto my Kindle. So, this is now stored locally on my computer and within the Calibre program. So, if we go to here, now you can do this two ways. You can do it up the center device, or you can right click here and do center device here. Now I am doing center device because I've got the cable connected, center main memory. So if we click that. Now this is the conversion project part of the program. As I've set it up in stage one to say that Kindle is my default reader, I can just go ahead and just do yes, and which will auto convert the books. Now we can check on the progress on this by clicking on jobs down here. Um, as you can see this is the current one it's converting so it's creating Moby output which is the Kindle format and it's 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 really quick this on um, some books it's a lot you'll notice it's a lot quicker than say for instance when you were downloading the uh, the news feeds for the Kindle because I'm already up to 67 percent so we're just going to leave that and let that go hopefully that shouldn't take too long so I don't have to break into song for you right there you go that's finished converting it and now it will be moving on to the uploading process so there you go it's finished already uploading and it's sent the metadata to the device so if we can close that now we can just double check that it's actually on the, the Kindle now but if you click here device um, if you've got it hardwired by the USB lead, you can click here and it'll show you what's actually on my phone, on my my Kindle. So as you can see, I've got Tale of the Two Cities there and it's transferred it. So, cool. That, that one's worked fine. Now, we're going to do something a, a bit more, um, well, it's, it's a bit more technical, as lo but as long as you've followed stage one, this is fine. So, we'll, we're going to do add an ebook, and then this one, we're going to add this Moby one, which is the standard Kindle format. Now, I don't want to send this to my Kindle via the lead. I'm going to actually send it via email. Um, so there's the new thing I've added, War of the Worlds by H.D. Wells. So now we're, what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and we're going to email it to the Kindle. So if you right click and then you do uh, Connect Share. Now here we go. You can choose all the recipients here. So this is already set up for my email, so if I click that, 
Now that is going to go ahead and email it. Uh, so if we click jobs, I'll let you watch it. So that is actually emailing it. And as you can see, that's really quick because it's already in Kindle format. So that has now been emailed to my Kindle. Now, the you, uh, as my Kindle is already hardwired to it, I can um, just go ahead and click on device and see what's on it. But in order to actually download the file, you need to go into your Kindle, turn the wireless on, and then do download and sync and that then will um, download the ebook which you have just sent to it so basically that that sums it, sums it up really so um, that's about it for now so you know hopefully this video is useful and I'll uh, catch you again in another video soon bye for now